Well, I was just having a quick flick for a fish, but seem to be every lure that I brought won't swim. So I swapped the rod over for the bow and walked back up. I was only just fishing just here. I just spotted what looks to be a pretty good ball. Making his way up through this little gully. Um, yeah, the wind's not the greatest, but I wasn't really planning on seeing anything up here this early. The plan was to get up through there and yeah, come around back on the back side of the wind there later the Sarvo. So, try and get in and get a better look at him. I've seen a few more piggy run off up here, that wind's just swirling around any. It's pretty wet in this grass here, I thought he would have been just in here having a wallow or something, but anyhow. He's a good chunk of war too. I was hoping to get a better look at him. I've been sitting here glassing for about the last hour. This thing here just walked out. He's a good boy. Shit spot. Try and keep an eye on him, see what he does. I thought I could hear pig squealing down there before, so whether or not he was half blue or not. I don't know, I was just I was sitting up here, just glassing, still pretty early. I spotted a good boar, a real good boar, got out of a while. I sort of across this creek here and there's blackberries. He's wandering up through. I oh, use a good old. I'm pretty sure I wasn't going to be able to get through this shit, but I thought I'd give it a crack. Come down, and as I was cutting around here, I've just come in onto a mob bedded down here. Probably about 50 yards. And they're all laying down, but it looks like there's a thumper laying there. Don't quote me on it, but it definitely looks like a big old laying there. When I first sat in up here, um, I was sure I heard pigs squealing. Just happened real quick, and um, yeah, I never really heard it again. So didn't know whether it was just birds or what it was. I think you won't see on this, but they're bedded straight in. I'm right there in them bushes there. So. I don't really have any option but to just sit her out and wait and hope this wind holds. And hopefully they'll get up and start feeding out this way into this open out here. And, yeah, I'm getting arrow in him. I want him. Definitely wouldn't mind trying to get him away from this blackberry because if he goes in there, I'll never find him. Well, uh, I was just heading over to that boar. I was seen just heading across that through the blackberries there. And um, yeah, I can't get over. There's that many blackberries in here. But I spotted these pigs here, bedded down in the shade of a blackberry, and I can't tell. That looks like a cracker of a boar lying there at the back of him. I think it is, eh? it definitely is. They're in a shit spot and I don't really have the greatest access to them. So I'm probably just going to have to hope I'll kill these wind holes. And um, sit around and hope they come up, get up and feed out into this rye grass. Still let me chance that window. Well, it's still sitting off these pigs. It's definitely a boar. Big ripped ear on him. I just shuffled down the hill I was sitting up there in the sun. Should have been warm, shuffled down. Yeah, I've been there and half till dark, so. I hope they will get up and move sort of within the next at least hour your patience will be wearing pretty thin blind yeah definitely i haven't 
really got much of a look. They haven't budged at all. Like they're all just still low in the exact same spots. He definitely looks like a cracker. Yep, the big fella. He's a good boy. You're testing me patience. She's. I can hear someone up behind me here next door in a quad runner. Oh, they don't come down this fence here. Oh, this, this quad runner coming down the fence. I'd rather come down the fence and pigs are straight in that bush. I can't believe that. He's right above me. Look, right there. That's a boundary right there. <sighs> Sitting off these pigs, they finally stood up. I might a cracker of a pig too. Now the neighbour turns up here. Right behind me. That's a boundary fence right here. This is all my only fighter boy. Can't believe it. Pigs, I think, are still in the bush. I think you'll see one still this way. I might just come along there in that bike. The rest of them pigs went over into that bush. That boy's just wandered out. He's just laid down. Just over to the side here, so. Back to the waiting game. It's probably just about to start heading out to them pigs. Spewing. Before I got this big old boy, he's up. Just before I was going to slide down, so I can get in. I get in in there, I should wish I did now, because I've only been about 30 yards from here. I just heard more pigs fighting over in here somewhere else. I'll see what way he's going to go, I just hope he doesn't feed back up this way. I want him to go that way. Just grab the other. Ten or fifteen down the hill here. Yeah. Or he's just feeding just there. I'll come down there, he's walked back in the little bit there. If he comes back out there, he'll be about thirty yards, just a touch over. Just worried worried where he'll go after he eating. So I'm always making his bed again now. Come here, there's a big man full of grass.
Martin. Here come. Don't want him to go in that bush. Like that. Far out. That plumbing. That was him going out the back. I can hear something in here. Fuck, it shakes up. Jesus, he's a good ball. I don't know if he's got much in the way of teeth, but he's a cracking ball. No, he's down. I can see the grass all kicking. He's out of that bush. He's gone down. Piss up. How good was that? Definitely tested my patience a bit. So. I was sitting up in there that whole time. And yeah, he come down. And just come out and he was down, or you'll see it, he was standing right in behind this bush here, just a touch over third. And die. That's awesome, he's probably one of the best balls I've seen here, I reckon. So we don't have a look at him, try to. <laughs> oh, I think that ball was better that half time. Really this is where he's laying on the first time. Right here. Yeah, it's just freshen that bed up. Mm. Still pig in here. Yeah, full of green grass. Yeah, he's on the other side, but I just gotta find a way through it. Well, I found my way through it. If you've never hunted blackberries, it's pretty awesome shit. Seeing him come through. You get the one this buddy. This is pretty awesome, man. Pretty cool. Oh yeah. Fuck, he's a tank. Drop a big tank. Oh, he's got a solid in here. Got a beast in the tank. Jeez. One of the biggest bees I've shot up here. You're getting me up. Jesus Christ, he's a good boy. Look at the shoulders on it. Through eating. Pickled him. Jesus Christ, he's a solid big bastard. Absolute stonker. Good hook there. Yeah, I think one hook must be broken. <laughs> yeah, one's broken. Man, he would have been a cracker with both of them. What a bore, eh? What a bore. Plenty of age you him all his grinders are worn off. Just a tank. Absolute tank. The shoulders on him. He'd be one of the biggest balls I reckon I've ever shot. To be honest, he'd have to be one of the biggest balls I've ever shot. Definitely off this block. Oh, that's unreal. That's unreal. <laughs> Again, yeah. yeah, so he's, he's got to be in his 90s. Best has to be in his 90s, I reckon. Maybe even a bit better. Oh, cool. Drag our mate over here, get some pictures, and get, have a look at him. He's up there, eh? He's a big hog. Beast of a thing. Jesus. Absolute beast of a thing. Big mountain butter. Tell you what. You won't get much better than that. I love hunting these critters, eh? Like, that's awesome. The boar I seen that I was originally coming over here to get, he was a big bastard too. I knew he didn't want to take our mate on here. 
Here's that bore. Um, yeah, it's hard to give you an idea of the size of him. He's a friggin' monster. So. Definitely by far one of the biggest boars I've ever shot with a bow. So. Big old prick. All started, I've seen another boar. I'm sitting up here just waiting to see what come out for the harbour. I've seen another good boar just right here. I was just going across this gully. I knew I was pushing shit uphill trying to have a go at him, but yeah, I figured I'd come over. At least try and they just spotted that mob bedded up there and see this big shouldered prick laying there. So. Probably been sitting there for two hours, I suppose, give or take. And, um, yeah, he finally got up, he started making a bed. And he's up there getting a bit of grass. And I, I grabbed another about 15, probably, yards, I suppose. And, yeah, had him, had me pin just over 30, and, yeah, I've pickled him, so. Absolute stonk of a ball, one broken hook, unfortunately. But I've been hanging to get one for the wall, so. If he had both hooks, I definitely would have caked him out. Absolute beast of a boar. Love it. Well, that wraps that up. Get out of here before it gets dark. Yeah, he's a beast. I'm pumped. That's what he's all about. He's a cracker. I was gonna say, if he wasn't broken, you'd definitely... I'd get him taxi down, I reckon. So, I don't know what his score point was. But not broken, he'd have to be getting up there a bit. Good stuff. Yeah, I'm staying up here tonight to get out of this blackberry stuff because I don't have a torch as usual. And, um, yeah, go back and have a few beers and cook a feed. And probably try and chase a deer in the morning, I reckon. So. We'll see how we get on. Yeah, even if I don't get anything else, I'm absolutely pumped with that. That's awesome. So. Uh, I'll get ahead of you.